morning and we are back. The closed season is finally over. We're here at Blackpool Pleasure Beach. I've never been here before. Um, I'm meeting uh, Chris and John. So uh, yeah, gonna go meet them in the Velvet Coaster. Heard a lot about that place, never been in there. So yeah, it's gonna be a really good day. I'm feeling it. The weather is shaping up to be quite nice. It was, uh, yeah, fairly easy drive down here. Took me about three and a half hours, but you know, traffic was flowing, so it was good. So yeah, I'm gonna go find the guides and um, yeah, get started on this new experience. Should we just park the car up? Um, I've got gone for a car park like literally right next to Blackpool, Pleasure Beach. Um, just because I think it would just be easier at the end of the day and you know, I know where I am then. Um, yeah, it was £15 for all day, which not too bad really I suppose. It's like, you know, it's no different to getting like VIP parking at Alton Towers I suppose. So uh, yeah, we're going to head down and... God, this place is actually a lot bigger than what I thought it was going to be. And the big one is massive! I saw that like miles away. I'm excited. Yeah, so we're finally here at Blackpool Pleasure Beach. And uh, here with their time, John. Big perm, obviously. Just waiting for them to uh, sort the tickets out. Get out here. This this is impressive. I'm looking forward to some, getting on some rides. Uh, is their time, John, now, look. Hello! Hey! Just waiting on Big big Perm and the family to meet us out here. I think we're going to head to Icon first because apparently it went down yesterday, so I don't want to miss that. True theme park love right there. Pleasure Beach is, well, first impressions, it's just like a mixed bag of all sorts. There's like new stuff, old stuff, Spongebob everywhere. Yeah, crazy. But, yeah, so heading over to Icon now, see what's happening there. dead today um, although I'm not comparing it to anything so I've never been here before but the other guys are saying it's pretty dead but yeah this is this is a good area let's bring the kids along so this is icon looks impressive but it also doesn't look running which is a bit worrying the guy on the uh, the ticket booth said it was it was working today so Hopefully it'll be starting soon. Oh, what well, hey, Rob? How's it going? Talking about me again. <laughs> Just saying there to my channel, which is John's Airtime. Subscribe. Subscribe. Um, we hope that it stays open today, or it reopens for Rob. Um, but yeah, I'm sure it will. I really do. I'm positive. We hope. We hope. We hope. Um, I think it'll. I think it will reopen in the next half an hour or so. But who knows? Who knows? And you Fingers know, it's only three and a half hours. For yeah, that's it. That's, that's all. It. Just do it again. Do it again. <laughs> Come next weekend. You know. It's about as close as I'm going to get to uh, Icon today. Yeah, don't be pessimistic. Don't be pessimistic. <laughs> Positive, aren't you? Yeah. It's gonna open and it looks like it's, it's, it's gonna open. It's just again, about ready. It's just about ready to go. I wouldn't go that far either though. Yeah. <laughs> a bit of a slow start with um, the sun has finally come out, which is nice. Been on just been on Derby Racer. Went on ice blast just before, which was having some issues, but they got it working in the end, which was a bonus. So now we're gonna see if Icon's looking like it's gonna open. If not, uh, I think the big one's gonna be the coaster of choice. <laughs> it's 
so I've managed to uh, do the big one which was an interesting experience it was uh, pretty rough but apparently it's normally pretty rough just not quite that rough but yeah just done the infusion as well which yeah, I'd recommend that one it's good it's no nemesis but it's good so uh, yeah can see what else we can fit in now before closing Just done Big Dipper. That was a nice first experience. <laughs> it's, it's been amazing watching Rob's reactions to some of these classic coasters. You know, I don't that's, think... that's, that's definitely a classic as yeah. well. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> they are good. They are good, but they are a bit, a bit rough. Yeah. <laughs> they're they're uh, a slight bit tired, but they're uh, an acquired yeah. taste. Like, oh, absolutely. It's like a, it's like a a fine wine. <laughs> it's a yeah. It's a winner though. Cheap bottle of plong. Yeah. <laughs> Either or, it's fine. Still does the job. <laughs> so John's getting suited up for Valhalla. Because the Burghouse, the knot. Yeah. <laughs> hey, there keeps is them. They're not made for today. Because <laughs> I've just said to the viewers, I'm not made them on here. Hey, <laughs> you know what I mean? I, I appreciate that, pal. Right, get them on. Let's do it. Let's do it. Oh, well, I'm doing it for the camera, right? Bit of Valhalla. Go on. Well, uh, ends the first pleasure beach day. It's um, yeah, it's been an emotional one. We've been uh, we was going to do Valhalla, but I think everyone had the same idea of doing Valhalla at the end, and it was like you know an hour and a half, two hour queue, so. Oh, so we're not going to be doing that this time. Going to come back in the summer, bring the rest of the clan with me, and then we'll uh, yeah hit the rest of the rides. Couldn't get on Icon, gutted. It was only open for about half an hour to an hour today. Didn't get on in that time because we was queuing for the big one for like two hours. But uh, yeah, all in all, it's been a good day. Got some new credits in. Um, you know, met some great people. Chris and John, fantastic people. You know, we you know, really appreciate you sort of. Let me tag along with you today and show me, show, show me the delights of Pleasure Beach. So uh, yeah, definitely be hooking up with them guys again. And uh, if you've made it this far, this far, thanks for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe. And I will see you in the next one. See you later, guys.